Sonic did a, of the day off stream. Let's go. Probably gonna be for all three, uh, for all the games uh, that these two, these two play. Oh. Okay. Please, what? please. What? YouTube, Rosalina, no. Diddy Kong, Little Mad. Just, just stay away Clouds. from the bottom left. Please stay away Clouds. from the bottom okay, left. Okay, we're gonna cloud. Okay. That's actually not to do that. That's just, oh, what? <laughs> okay, no. <laughs> Come on, Rad. Wow. I'll have to pick his pocket. Come on, Rad. I he, know it's not even the He final. had like, he showed off like 10 pockets, and I'm pretty sure none of them were like <laughs> even existing. I'm pretty sure, like, he, he, he doesn't play a lot of characters. Well, he plays a lot of characters, but there's some characters that he never touches. And, like, Olimar and Jigglypuff were definitely some of them. Olimar is definitely a character that's known to just not be touched by a lot of people in the community. I always forget about Alf. <laughs> right. I don't even count him. Anyway, <laughs> we're going into this game. I've seen a lot of spin dashes. Spin dash up there. <laughs> hey, at least these guys are approaching. <laughs> Alright, wanted an air dodge, not getting it, so I need to jump in out. Honestly, if Wrath wanted to, Wrath could just, uh... Wrath, I mean, Wrath, no one, like, as far as, as, far as anyone knows, Wrath can play the, the camping game better than anyone else can. Right. Of course, of all people, it would be Wrath. Yep, and... Sunido might just be outclassed here, but however, he's doing that extremely upper well. Kill. Yep. Why that kill? <laughs> I know it was Too high close up, to the blast zone, yeah. I know it was really high, but why that kill? It also has a lot of knockback, and Wrath was at an, an, like, a decent amount of rage. Moderate too. amount of rage. Yep, just enough rage to actually get take, take that stock, and right now, Wrath's sitting a little less than 100, and uh, takes just enough. One of the up smash. Right now, Sunido has to play the ledge well enough to get a kill, because right now, Wrath is actually bringing this back. Pretty He's evenly. Establishing a really good read right now. Ooh, that spring catching him. Oh, oh catches the tech, punches him in the face. Sunido. Taking that stock. Rad definitely try to go for a duff. <laughs> just to just yeah. clock him just to clock him in the face. Just be like, no, you know who's better. Come on. <laughs> hey, who knows? But yeah, Sunido, not unless he has something to say about it. I feel like that was an air dodge read, but he was way too far away, so that's even work. These two are actually being really aggressive right now. There's no like pulling back or anything. Yeah, there's actually a Sonic Ditto I enjoy watching. <laughs> They're really reaching with the spin dash. That backer is not gonna kill because the nerf. <laughs> I'm, I'm always so scared. Like you know, like sometimes like you can't two frame like that, but Sonic S Smash, it's so big, it's so quick. It happens all the time. I, I always get so scared. All right, Tresco for an air dodge read on the down air, but he spaces it. And Wrath hits him with the forward air. Not going to do it yet. Sunido at a, almost 160%. Ooh, mixing up with a neutral B. See, that move that does have Back throw, going to not take it yet. Not exactly at the ledge. I was actually about to say he was going to take it, but I, I corrected myself just in time. Sunido kicking him off. Stage control. Wrath still in it back. Get the ledge. It's so scary. However, we did see we did see uh, Rath take a really early kill. So Sunido, I'm assuming Sunido does know enough about this character to kill early enough. That's so smash will kill. That oh, smash no, will kill from both of them. Up there will take it. Yes. All right. Rath clutching it out, taking game one. However, Sunido did well enough to keep up with Rath. So. Uh, where do you think they're gonna go next? I don't know anything about Sonic State besides like. Sonic does like Sonic does like any stage, honestly. Um, I'm assuming they want to go somewhere with plat. Well, I'm assuming Wrath wants to go somewhere with platform. Town, probably town. He does kill early enough on town. Both Sonics do. Um, but Sunido is going cloud, and he probably wants to go to Smashville. All right. The classic. The classic. Why change? Oh, he changed. Cloud. Yep. I just noticed. Cloud does extremely well in this matchup. Raz says Sonic wins like 55 45, but he still doesn't like it. Like, it's just so annoying. It's like up air, up air, up air, up air. Catches Sonic so well. Yeah, it's like playing a Ganon. Like, yeah, you, your matchup, yeah, you definitely win 60 40, however, you know, you don't want to fight it. When Cloud's off stage, it's just 80 20. 
Yeah, I mean, right now, Wrath is doing extremely well. Like, he has to burn limit right here, too. And he has, he has to take percent as well. I need to want some sort of opening, but Rats mixing like the shield, spin dash the shield so well. Finally gets, gets a 19% on the cross slash. Okay, good tech. Ooh, he, got the, he got the tech in place, Reed, but then Simi is smartly jumping out. That downer is not going to take that stock. Yeah, cloud heavy enough, however, that back air is not going to take it as well. So, right now, Wrath. At a really moderately good percent. However, we do see, we do know that Cloud does have that burst factor with his limit. He does have the movement. He does have the kill power. So Sunido, okay, Knocking that, if spike. that is spike. That would oh, have been the late back air. unfortunate. Knocking the void. I'm, and that's it. He loses jump. Yep. Oh, he had a jump. Oh, okay. Well, good stuff to Sunido for saving the jump then. Turn tap jump off, boys. Sneak All in the back right, air. that was really good of him to just shield, anticipating the aerial, and then just catch him with a cross slash. I oh, don't uh, know. Uh, finishing touch. Yep. Right. Now we saw Sanito in a deficit like this, but he was really close to bringing him back that game one. And of course, Cloud does have the clutch factor. Tries to read the tech option or the roll option, but misses it. That's kind of landing in all the wrong places where Sunido can kind of like just catch him or shield grab up there. Rath should really be pulling out with this lead. All right, oh, it's with an up air. That could have been a fishing touch. Here dodge the stage. Rath has got to be careful about how he uses, uh, how he um, utilizes his moves and what options he chooses. Okay, that was a nice catch. Bad and that's gonna take it. Barely going under Sunido. Sunido gets the cross slash. I don't think it's really set. I think it took like 10% that whole time, uh, second stock. Yeah, good stuff to Sunido. Really got into Wrath bad. Wrath was taking a lot of percent, falling into a lot of things, getting grabbed a lot. Yeah, well, while Wrath did have a dominating uh, first stock, uh, Sunido did clutch out, which, you know, clouds do that extremely well. And Sunido making the right place to get there as well. Wrath's a really good first place. So, like, what he needs to do right now is just, like, t tell himself, yo, I just need to repeat what I did last game. And just, like, try to not... Extend so far. Ooh, he's still going for the fancy stuff. Spring's not gonna. Spring's not gonna do the lock. Not going down fast enough. However, Rath, no, Rath showing that he's not playing around anymore. He wants to get the easy percent. He wants to get the optimal punishes. Now you're seeing the sleep from Rath like we saw game two. But <laughs> we all know how that ended. Yeah. Just, Rath really just has to like kick back, relax. Don't reach too far, because that's. I think what really like hurt him uh, that game too. All right, the dash attack. Still in stage control. Even at zero, dash attack can easily uh, win you some stage control. If all clouds move. Moves to them. Moves. Just Cloud. they all do angle, insane knockback. Near angle, even though it's like ten percent. Oh whoa! Okay, he gets back. a sweet spot on the on the Breath spring. Close but. enough to F smash. Interesting. Oh. He chose to stay that far back. advantage of Rath's kind of slow tempo charging. That's a big thing about the Sonic matches. You gotta, you gotta really be able to differentiate whether they're trying to play slow or really trying to get in. And you could really adjust your play style based on that. The thing about the Sonic matchup as well is that at a certain percent Sonic stuff does, so, Sonic does, uh, has stuff that's not true. Like, he, his stuff doesn't become true out of spin dash at a certain percent. That's why Sunido isn't like He's not getting killed by aerials. Jumping right past the spring, getting right there. Now this is Rage Cloud with limit, so all Sunil really needs is one confirm. And he's able to go the extra mile. I could have sworn he was going to just keep on juggling him, but let him land him back on stage. Back throw. He wanted to grab because he saw the spin dash shield. Barely, like, barely not being able to reach that far, far enough. Jumping out. Yes, in the right position is just jump out of that cross slash. Do you could, can Sonic, cause like Sonic's fast, really fast. Do you think he could punish the Pharaon shield? Like, yeah, that's a lot of shields done, but like Sonic's really fast. Do you think he can reach? Uh, it depends on. I mean, the thing is that Cloud's auto cancel the fair, so like, he should, like Cloud should be able to like do an option right afterwards. So it depends. Jumping over the spin dash, catching with an air. 
I guess not fair. Jumping situation. I thought he didn't have a spring. Tony is kind of getting greedy. Yeah. Trying to get a hit on him. He's trying to land with falling up there as he really wants the kill. Dash attack. It's been dash. Can he blame him? He's got he's to fight a Sonic. With a lead? Sonic with a lead. With a secondary, no less, because his own Sonic just it, he felt like right. he wasn't cutting it. Everyone always beams about Sonic with a lead, about how he's so good, but then, like, if you've ever played someone like Wrath with a lead, dang, it feels bad. Sonic is just unre unre unrepresented just enough to where people just don't complain about him. To the point, like, they do, like, currently with Bayonet and Cloud. A lot of people moved on from Sonic, but even with that in mind, like, when Wrath's oh, on no, stream... Georgia, Georgia still on knows. Stream. Georgia yeah. knows. When Wrath's on stream, like, at CEO versus Sal uh, Wrath vs. Salem, the Twitch chat was so salty. It was unbelievable. But that's just Twitch chat. That's just Twitch chat. But still, like, it's the same. Like, yeah. I guess, like, it's like the same feeling. Everyone's mad. All right, right now, both of them at high percent. However, ooh, that recovery. One player has a stock. He's going to take it. Yep. Somebody confirmed 